Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Libra. Thank you God for blessing Libra with a clear, concise message from you. So Libra, some relationship um, it might be a little mundane, boring but committed and loyal all together, okay? So you don't have to worry about this person's commitment, devotion, dedication to you. It might be a little boring, but they're definitely um, dedicated to the, the relationship. They're dedicated to you, okay? They haven't, and, and even if you're in the outs with this person, this person is still dedicated to you. I don't know why. I'm still committed to you. Uh, or the relationship is gonna take a turn to uh, more of a commitment. Let's see what's going on for Libra this week going on for labor yeah the three of cups so it could be reconciliation um you guys reconcile so you reconcile your differences how you're thinking your mindset your emotions um you may even speak with friends family people close in your community that can give you um, good advice better advice so that you can come back together with someone so that you can have uh, enjoyment there could be some good news coming in or you, that you're giving the good news it could be of a promotion pregnancy new job it could be anything but it's good news that causes for celebration all right um also some of you having your birthdays you've had a birthday um so um you're just celebrating with friends people are celebrating you this week uh labor uh, it could be people in your home or your community it close to you all right what is the advice for Libra this week. The advice for Libra this week. What's the advice for Libra? What's the advice for Libra this week? What's the advice for Libra? What's the advice for Libra? What's the, okay. The two of pentacles. So things may be up in the air. Don't plan anything. Don't plan on anything. Don't get too upset. Um, go with the flow here, says the two of pentacles. Um, be... Be malleable. Be, um, yeah, be, uh, go with the flow, okay? Uh, don't be too rigid. Um, you also may have two different things you're going to do. Maybe family, friends want to do something with you, and then another group. Um, you can have two different parties that you're going to also. Um, the Two of Pentacles talks about the court jester. So it's like maybe you'll have um, some entertainment at your, your, your party. Uh, whatever you're doing, it looks like you're you're um, balancing out really well. You could be balancing out your books. You could be balancing out things, your finances, transferring money, or you're doing two different things to earn income here. It looks good. Um, you're staying afloat. Things are floating. And things are growing here with the Two of Pentacles. The work that you're doing now is going to show up in the Four of Pentacles when you have that stability, that newfound wealth. So keep going in whatever you're doing. What is the outcome here for my Libras this week? The lover is very nice. So some transformative or some opportunity to, to make a choice, a significant choice. Um, you may also go on a date or someone may um, yeah ask you out. You may meet someone new, um, your right place, right time, uh, where the angels have brought you and something or somebody else together. Therefore, you can make the choice. Um, do you want to engage? Because you still have free will. Um, but the lovers here, it's like, um, maybe you're going to do something you love doing or somebody's going to do something, someone you love is going to do something nice for you. Someone's going to show up in a different capacity um, to where uh, things turn out well. You also realize that maybe somebody is your soulmate, twin flame, whatever you subscribe to, that it's the perfect connection. Give me one card. Happy birthday, Libras, too. Give me one card for um, the lovers card. You could be dealing with a Gemini. You could have two different options. Some, you, that's what I'm saying. You could have two different parties, two different people coming to you. I want to do this for you. I want to take you here. Then you have another somebody saying, like, yeah, I want to do this, and I want to take you here, and I want to do this and that. Um, the Five of Cups here. Um, yeah, somebody may be wanting to come to you and make things right. They're in that grief-stricken phase. They feel like maybe you're not talking to them. You're making a choice to be with someone else has caused them a lot of grief they feel like something has been taken away from them that you know they're just at a place of um grieving the loss of but it says that the relationship is reconcilable um 
it's recoverable. You just you guys have to um, actually make that choice to do so. You have to come out of grief, come out of being separated. Somebody actually has to move towards the other person. So if you're dealing with that situation where, you know, you want to go towards someone or someone wants to come towards you, do so. They're waiting for you. You're waiting for them. But somebody has to move here. This is what I have for you, Libra. If it resonates, go over to the website. It could be dealing with a Piscean person. Um, if it resonates for you, go over to the website, book there. Also, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel. If you feel like you took something from the reading, you could give something back. You could click the Buy Me a Coffee link and buy me a coffee. Thank you, guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.